You see the brother sitting in the chair crying? Yeah, that's me. I've been dealing with stress from family problems, community peer pressure, strange women, coping with the death of my childhood friend, being a musician, smoking the herbs. And I think today is when I say fuck it. And don't go in the refrigerator with your big eating ass. All I wanted to do was hustle my royal smoke incense, look out for others, my best friend Dank, and of course take care of and protect my angels. I'm just trying to get us on the Herb Train Festival and smoke out. Take the car, man. Yeah, man. Just take my shit, man. Bring my shit back just like I gave it to you. You already know. All right. Love you, man. All right, nigga. Fuck that nigga, man. This little young nigga got no skinny jeans on. I don't know you. No, for real. If you want some ice cream, go to the store. Oh, you probably don't have no money. You probably broke. Give me that damn ice cream. What the hell? Mama! What's going on, King? Talk to me. I'm about to go serve some niggas like no. goddamn church. That's what the fuck no. I'm gonna do. So, I'm tired. Love you. You know what I'm saying? Goddamn, I'll be back before breakfast. Fuck. No. Bust his head open. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna whip his head, bro. Yo, yo. Nigga, just be, please, goddamn, be still. Be goddamn still. Yo, you got a clip in there, go I'm for it. Babe Ruth tonight, nigga. I tell y'all what, this is that bullshit. Let's go. Ding 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 ding. Ding 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 ding. Party is lit. That's what I was just telling my man. Yeah. Crazy. Yeah. Oh, oh, you talking about? That's a wild party. Ding 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 ding. Ding 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 ding. Bring in the party, no the party can't done. All the girls them cause is piping up on. All I asked you to do was come in here, bring my incense, get the money out the drawer, take your llama lip ass down there with the motherfuckers, and shut my motherfucking door. Dang. All the girls them cause is piping up on. I'm a bridge in them, I'm a true rasta man. And we're not afraid of no man. We're here with uh, Cayenne, the Lion King. Uh, definitely uh, want to get a background uh, history because uh, it sounds like uh, you have a lot going on. Um, how did you get started into uh, doing films? Yeah, I started doing uh, films, man, um, because, like, you know, the craziest thing is one of my sons, he, he uh, fell in love with the camera, man. You know, I try to keep them in front of positive things. So I had an idea to do a movie, but I wasn't motivated to do it because I know it takes a lot. But when I found him um, falling in love with that camera, I said, yo, I'm going to keep you in front of it. It'll keep you out of trouble, and yo, man, here we are today, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's cool, man. Is this the uh, first film that you've uh, worked on? Yeah, 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 it okay. is, man. Um, okay. And then uh, the craziest thing about it, I found out it's like the, the first urban comedy that's coming out of North Carolina like like, like it is, you know? Um, you know, I know they've got a lot of stuff going on in Wilmington or whatnot, and, you know, the only really black film that I saw come out of there is, uh, uh, what was it, uh, Black Knight with... Uh, Martin Lawrence, and it was the next one or whatnot, but it wasn't no like independent released uh, urban comedy, you know what I'm saying? So okay. I'm the first to do that one, bro. Oh, that, that's that's cool right there, man. Yeah. So so how long have you uh, been into music and uh, making music, man? Yo, uh, man, I, I've been doing music since eight years old, family. Um, you know, ironically, uh, my granddad used to ghost write for Atlanta Rackets back in the 50s, 60s, you know what I'm saying? Um, my dad, he he uh, did music with a lot of musicians, you know, um, in Atlanta, you know, like with um, Isaac Hayes, people, Bryson, um, you know what I'm saying, Temptations and, and, and Sam Cooke. I mean, Otis Redden, you know, he was around a lot of them guys, you know what I'm saying? Wow, yeah. Um, so uh, he started doing some um, R&B, Christian music, you know what I'm saying, on, on some Al Green type style. So once he started doing that, man, I was... One of his little backup singers, you know what I mean? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. My, my, all my uncles was the instrumentalist, so, you know, it was pretty dope, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah. So, um, is some of the work on the what? Unorthodox, yeah, yeah. Is, is some of that work uh, used in, in the actual film? I, I think I heard some on the trailer, and I was just curious if you got a yeah. soundtrack or anything for that. Yeah, um, Blah 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 is like the first single I'm going to be pushing off of uh, Unorthodox. Um, and, um, of course, I put that in the movie or whatnot to give it some light, some highlight. Um, the soundtrack itself, man, like right now, if I was to do a true soundtrack for the movie, 
I got 55 tracks up in that joint. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, so um, I didn't realize that until we started really narrowing it down and seeing what scenes we're gonna keep. So what happened is, um, we had a meeting the other day, and I said, "Yo, bro, I'm gonna have to, you know what I'm saying? Like do like 15, 20 type joints. You know what I mean? And, oh yeah, um, yeah. It's gonna be pretty dope. Uh, everything work out. Uh, I'm gonna have some." some dope features on it too man word up that sounds good man yeah i heard uh, at the beginning of the um trailer for uh the herb train the ding 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 song and yeah, i like man. the way that came in yeah, yeah yeah i appreciate that that ding 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 joint man um that's um um that one's gonna be it should be on the album i'm working on called iron mike's wooden max man i got like 13 albums i'm working on right now man i i put them on the back barn, burner for like a year or two you know what i'm saying because it took a year to film this movie you know what I mean? Um, for me to learn, you know, the process and put people in certain places, man. But um, yeah, I'm gonna be back at it, man. Once I, you know, release the movie on 420, um, I'm gonna be in the studio. You know what I mean? Oh, most definitely. And, and so, anything else? I, I know that you're having uh, um, some type of uh, fundraiser on the 15th for the movie. Um, yeah. Okay. My fault. I didn't mean to cut you off. No, no, you're fine. Uh, yeah, but yo, um, ironically, you saying that uh, because I got a phone call and. The guy over there, he double booked me, uh, so I'm gonna have to push that back to February the 22nd. Oh, so, gotcha. um, yeah, it's gonna be at Jamaica, Jamaica in Durham, North Carolina on Highway 54. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna start around by like 9:30. You know, people can come through, um, get the first look at the new uh, Herb Train gear. You know, the T-shirts, cups. Uh, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, um, I might have some real exclusive for them that night, but I might wait for the premiere. Oh, you know yeah. what I mean? You know, you know, you gotta, you gotta, you know, you gotta bait them and give them new <laughs> products, man. Yeah, I, I be, I be wanting to give, give them just everything at one time. Yeah, but, you know, yeah, yeah. It might be, you know, product overload, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Got to save a little something, but yeah, I'm definitely right. uh, excited about that premiere, man. And, and so that, that's <clears throat> dropping on 420, right? Yeah, man. Yeah. Um, I thought that would be clever to drop it on 420. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people, because I'm, a, I'm a, um party promoter too man and uh that's how a lot of people know me from back in the days for throwing like big parties and whatnot in durham you know i even got featured in 2007 in the, um you know the vibe magazine you know what okay. i'm saying so yeah bro um so what happened is um i said yo a lot of cats been asking me for years to throw a party on 420 i said yo might as well throw a red carpet, you know, movie for me on that joint. You know what I'm saying? Oh, most definitely, yeah. Well, I, I definitely, from the trailer, man, everything looks professional, man. It, it looks like it's going to be a, a good movie, man. Uh, the trailer yeah. has definitely got my attention, and I look forward to for what you, uh, for the premiere and everything else that you got going on, man. Is there anything else you want to uh, add, uh, let people know what's coming up or anything? Well, I mean, you know, um, like I said, I'm working on these 13 albums, man. Um, Big up to all the producers that's involved with whatnot, drugs, beats, knocks, uh, you know what I'm saying? Yo, my man Watkins the general, King God Divine, you know what I mean? Just a whole lot of lot of lot of dope producers and Grammy nominated producers. Um, you know, so look out for those albums, dope metaphors, unorthodox two and three, um, Iron Mike's Wooden Mask, you know, joint called Lion Throne. Um, yo, know, just got a lot of new music that I'm blessed everybody with. Uh, of course, the soundtrack for uh, the Herb Train. Uh, want to see y'all in the theater? We only got 100 seats, 175. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, 420 of this year, we be premiering my first movie. You know what I'm saying? Black Lion Sound Films. It started nine o'clock. Put on your good church clothes, your Easter suits. You know, whatever, whatever. You know what I mean? Come out there, get some dope pictures, autographs with uh, me and the cast. And um, you know what I'm saying? Like uh, at 10:15, we're gonna show the movie, man. And I really hope y'all enjoy. It's an hour and 45 minutes, so get popcorn and drink. <laughs> <laughs> Most definitely, man. Well, I appreciate you. Yeah, I know you're busy, man. I appreciate you taking the time out to speak with us, man. And definitely look forward to, to seeing that movie and your music that you got coming out, man. Thanks a lot, man. Yeah, well, yo, shout out to you and your team, man. It's always an honor when brothers reach out and want to even hear my voice. You know what I'm saying? So, yo, man, don't let this be the last time I hear your voice, man. If you can, come out there. We'll rap you know off the air see how we can work some things out for you and the crew you know what i mean and uh yo man just keep it locked right here man i'm gonna do the same fam you know most definitely i appreciate yeah, it man, man. Uh, yo let me just tell everybody go check out my instagram too you know what i'm saying yeah check out my instagram i'll be putting some, i'm about to start putting some funny skits out there it's kaya and the lion king it's c-a-y-e-n-n-e-t-h-e-l-i-o-n-k-i-n-g and then on my uh facebook check me out you know it's kaya 
music, you know, C-A-Y-E-N-N-E-M-U-S-I-C. You know what I'm saying? So, yo, just keep a lot right here, man. We got a lot of good stuff, man. I'm going to be teaming up with Carolina Fine.